Hey guys, today's video, we are going to be redoing a reef. Um, so we're going to basically get a cheap reef. You can buy them anywhere. Um, you know, if you're out thrifting, if you like going thrifting, you can find a really good deal on some reefs or you can get a plain reef somewhere and you can always spruce it up yourself. So today what we're going to do is we're actually going to light this reef. So this reef here is, I don't know, maybe four feet in diameter. And it's, uh, I found it at my local thrift store actually. And <clears throat> sorry. And it was, uh, $29.99. So regular, like a four foot reef like this, sorry, you guys can't see, but a four foot reef like this would, you know, relatively go really like, you know, $175, $200. So I got the reef itself for $29.99. And the reason why I got this reef for so cheap is because, let me just show you. So thinking when I bought this that the lights were all gonna work on it. However, they do not. So they are only in the inside tier. And then what I did was I added these kind of balls to the middle of it. Now, some of them are still like they're just not working um, and it's really getting pretty ghetto. So what I'm gonna do is, <clears throat> I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to keep the white here cause I do like the white tips there. And then I'm gonna put in a new set of lights on this reef. So the new set of lights on this reef are looking, whoop, look like this. So. You know me and you know that I always go to Costco. Um, I absolutely love it. Um, but these packs here, and I wanted these last year, but I looked, I blinked, and you know how Costco is. If you don't pick it up in the moment, you're pretty much screwed and it's gone. And then you have to wait another season. So I actually had to wait a whole year just to pick these bad boys up. So they came in and they were gone like that in a flash at my local um, Costco. But you get two 50 set lights. Um, and so it's 100 lights in total. And it was only $19.99, uh, believe it or not. And these lights are absolutely gorgeous. Um, the reason why I love them is because, I'll be honest with you, you know, I absolutely love pink. So pink is in this one. And I just love the colors that illuminate from it. So here, I'll show you guys what the colors actually look like. And they're really big balls. Like the balls are huge. Um, so that's what they look like guys. They're really, really pretty. Um, and what I did was I bought four boxes of these because I have um, railings that I've decorated with boughs, um, which I've done for my outdoor set, like my outdoor kind of scene for Christmas this year. But this is what they look like. And let me just plug them in for you guys just so you can kind of see what they actually are all about it. So let me unplug this bad boy because we're going to de-reef that guy and we're going to put in these guys and I'm going to put it in the front of the house. But here it is. Look at these colors, guys. Like, honestly, they're absolutely beautiful. I'm, I'm so excited to put these into this reef. I've been wanting to do this for over a year <laughs> and you know, it's no better time than to share it with you guys, right? So let's kind of deconstruct the, the reef right now. And then what we'll do is we will go in and put in the new strand. And then after once it's done, I'll definitely show you guys uh, what it looks like. So let's get started. <laughs> I love to tend to decorate with things that I absolutely love um, and create an environment too within the home that is, you know, really like inviting and fresh and, um, you know, keep it fun, guys. Remember, your house is your castle and you guys are the king of your castle or queens of your castle. And, you know, you only live once, so you might as well live life in luxury. Okay, like I said, I'm gonna keep the white. I'm taking out the other lights already, right? So 
Um, what I'm going to do is if I don't like the white, I'm taking it right out. Absolutely right out. I'm going to fast forward and I'm just going to do the lights uh, in here. And then we will be back uh, just to show you what it looks like with the inner one done. And then we'll uh, pause, talk about it a little bit. Um, and then what we'll do is we'll go in to the outside circle um, and capture that as well on a fast forward. Okay, well, here we go. Because I know you guys don't want to watch me set up lights. Um, you know what I mean? That's pretty boring. So um, let's go on fast forward. See you in a bit.
Okay, everyone. So we have got our first inside done. It actually looks really good. I'm surprised that it's camouflage. So I guess without further ado, I'll show you. So we started over here. I know I got to cut the tags off. Okay. So forgive me, but look what we've got so far, guys. Pretty good, eh? I mean, honestly, I think it's turning out really, really good. I still have the outer edge to do, so that's what we're gonna do next. Um, but I'm really, really pumped about this. It's actually a good, nice wreath. So, um, I mean, for the price tag of $29.99 and a $10 light strand, you have a four foot wreath for what? $39.99. So that's really, really good, guys. Um, so, so far, I'm kind of loving it. And uh, what we'll do is we'll go into the outer edge now and get the rest done. Um, so, yeah, let's get this party started. I love it. <laughs>
guys, we have the final reef done. It is actually full. I've put in all of the lights. And now what we just got to do is just filter through um, and make sure that our cords aren't showing, um, which we will do. So basically all you want to do, guys, is just kind of tuck your cords in. So what do you think? Tell me what you think about this, guys. This wasn't actually that bad of a project. Um, and it was fun. There will be more projects that we will be doing <laughs> in the next few, you know, weeks to come because it is Christmas. And Christmas is one of my favorite times of year. So I really hope that you enjoyed this video um, of making a Christmas wreath on the cheap, I guess, um, and not having to actually buy one that's actually pre-installed. We could do this ourselves. Um, and it's super, super simple. Um, and most lights always have clips at the end of each light. So you just clip those into the branches and weave it into the wreath as you go. So thanks again, guys, for tuning in. Tell me pretty lights. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me, even if it's fake.